there's really not a whole lot of prep work on the patient's part in terms of getting ready for the port. Um, if you have any pertinent medical records, if you've had prior line placements in the past, you know, it's a good idea to have that information on hand so you can speak to your nurses and physicians about that. But really, you know, most of the patient prep comes down to um, uh, getting ready for the procedure in terms of being NPO the night before. And what that means is we will tell our patients not to have anything to eat or drink after midnight the night before their procedure is scheduled. The reason for this is so it's safe to give them sedation for the procedure. Um, without that status of having them, um, you know, with nothing on their stomach, we can't give them conscious sedation for the procedure. So we will typically call our patients the day before to remind them about their procedure. We'll remind them that they can have whatever they want up until midnight in terms of food and drink, but we'll remind them not to have anything the following day, except uh, if they need to take medications with sips of water. That's totally fine. And patients can actually have clear liquids up to two hours prior to the procedure as well. So most of the prep work on the patient's part is just making sure that they don't have anything to eat or drink prior to the procedure.